I'm joined by the legendary Curtly Ambrose. We're here to talk about Kemar Roach passing 500 first class wickets. First of all, what would you like to say to him? What can I say to Kemar Roach? I mean, he deserves every wicket. I mean, he's been playing for a long time. He's a he's a not only a cricket player, but a guy who I have a lot of time for. Very respectful, easy to work with. And I mean, I just want to say to Kima, man, kudos. 500 wickets, nice milestone, but it's not over. Continue and just go as long as you can, my brother. Just stay positive and stay fit, and I know you're going to be okay. Hey, you mentioned the fact you're hoping that he keeps going. Obviously, yourself being a former fast bowler, I mean, you probably tell yourself you still bowl it these days. Well, don't even joke about it. <laughs> just mentioning that, I'm already tired. <laughs> no, but um, I, I do enjoy what I do coaching, commentating, just look at the game from a different angle without being involved, you know. So um, giving back to cricket, not only West Indies cricket, but cricket in general means a lot to me. You know, just giving back my knowledge and experience to aspiring cricketers and even international cricketers, doesn't matter. You know, as long as I can give back, I get some sense of satisfaction, you know, so I do enjoy it. Yeah, I can definitely tell that, Ambi. Final question for you. Why do you think Kimar has been so successful across his career? Well, first of all, longevity, right? Uh, we know when he started first, a few years back, he was genuinely quick. And then injuries plagued him a little bit, lost a lot of his pace, but he still possessed the skills, which tells me and others that he doesn't have to be a tier away fast bowler to get wickets. He used those skills that he possessed and... He was just a phenomenal guy to work with. And like I said, man, I have all the time in the world to keep my watch, right? I just want to wish him continued success. And just the other day, I presented him with a shirt when he, when he passed the 250 miles to the chess squad cricket. Now he got the 500 first class and he promised me that he'd stick around long enough to get the 300 test wicket. So Kima, I'm reminding you, don't break your promise to me. <laughs> all the best, my friend. Well, there you have it, folks. And there you have it, Kimar. Do not break your promise to Ambi. Yeah, you're a number one cricket fan. Thanks a lot. Yeah, my pleasure. Good man.